Uh, what's up, everybody? We're going to talk about a simplified UI today. Very easy. Found this pretty awesome UI on DeviantArt, which the link is in the description. And uh, the process to change this is pretty easy. And I'm going to show you guys that you don't have to be afraid. First, we're going to go to the C Windows System 32 folder because uh, we're on a 64 bit operating system and we want to change that first. Uh, you could do uh, either or the SysWild 64 or that one. Doesn't matter which one you want to do. Uh, first, we're going to take ownership of the authui.dll file. I'm going to go to security, advanced, owner, and change the owner to the current user. Talked about this in the last video. Now, once you got that business done, we're going to go edit the permissions on that said user that you just made the owner of the file. Windows is going to complain because you're touching it. And it's naughty spots. We're going to name this something that you will remember. You know, something like old, original, don't delete old now these folders each one represents a different color around your icon and first we're going to copy the 64-bit file and windows might complain so i'm going to go in the command prompt and use xcopy to copy over the file and there you go there's the file in there and now we're going to browse to your syswow 64 folder that is your 32-bit files in windows 64-bit now we're going to do the same thing to this guy I'm going to take ownership Windows will complain, cry, scream, kick, say no, 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 don't touch me there. But we're going to do it. We're going to do it anyways. We're going to make that user also have all permissions on that file. And then we're going we're gonna to rename that file to something you can remember. And then we're just going to X copy from the 32-bit folder to that folder, meaning the X32 folder to SysWild64. Once you get that business going you will see the file sitting happily in there next to your backed up quote unquote file and uh, that's about it that's that's really how easy it is to do this you really shouldn't be afraid of doing this unless you're uncomfortable doing it then maybe have a more technical friend doing it but there's the simplified UI isn't that pretty no more silly boxes thanks for watching everybody